uh, good afternoon and uh, welcome my dear followers ladies and gentlemen in this video i am going to explain some of the theoretical background of uh, translog cast function and uh, after explaining that background and the theory of translog uh, cast function i'll uh, estimate uh, some of the empirical work and the data used by william h green so to do that let me first uh, Uh, briefly uh, introduce the translog function uh, translog function is one of the most frequently used flexible functions in empirical research work and if you if you look at 14.37 uh, this is the translog cast function which is equal to log of c that is equal to beta plus beta 1 log p1 up to beta m log pm plus sigma 11 One by two log square p i plus sigma one two log p one log p two, and finally up to sigma m m times one by two log square p m. Now this is the translog cast function, and uh, if uh, sigma i g equals zero, then this function reduces to the Cobb-Douglas production function, uh, the Cobb-Douglas function uh, that we have studied in uh, economics and uh, mathematical economics. and uh, the cast shares equation are given by 14.38 there are three uh, there are a number of equations starting from s1 s2 up to sm so s1 is the share of uh, uh, input 1 in the total cast s2 is the share of input 2 in the uh, total cast sm is the uh, share of uh, mth input in the total cast so these are the equation uh, the input share uh, equation in the total cast the cast share must sum to 1 which requires in addition to the symmetry restrictions already imposed and uh, for that purpose beta 1 plus beta 2 up to beta m must be equal to 1 that is the cast share must equal to 1 uh, summation i varies from 1 to m sigma ij is equal to 0 that is the column sum is Uh, column sums equal 0 and uh, the row sums equal 0 and that is sigma j varies from 1 to m uh, sigma ij uh, is equal to 0 uh, the system of share equations provide a seemingly unrelated regressions model that can be used to estimate the parameters of the model uh, to make the model operational we must impose the restriction in uh, 14.39 and solve the problem of singularity of the disturbance covariance matrix of the share equations the first is accomplished by dividing the first m minus 1 prices by the mth uh, thus eliminating the last term in each row and column of the parameter matrix uh, as in cobb douglas model we obtain a non singular system by dropping the mth share equation we compute maximum likelihood estimates of the parameters to ensure variance with respect to the choice of which share equation we drop for the translog cast function the elasticities of substitution are particular uh, practically uh, particularly uh, simple to compute once the parameters have been estimated and uh, these parameter these uh, uh, elasticities of substitution uh, are given in these two equation uh, 14.40 these elasticities will differ at every data point uh, it is common to compute them at uh, some central point such as the means of the data using an example uh, from the green william h green book econometric analysis a number of recent studies have used translog methodology uh, in which uh, they have used a four factor model including k for capital l for labor e for energy and m for materials as the factors of production among the first studies to imply this methodology was uh, barnt and uh, woods 1975 estimation of a translog cast function for the us manufacturing sector the three factor shares used to estimate the model are these sk where sk is the share of uh, capital in the total cast and uh, this equation is given by sk is equal to beta k plus uh, sigma kk log uh, pk divided by pm plus sigma kl times log Uh, pl divided by pm plus sigma ke log pe divided by pm and similarly uh, sl and uh, se are the shares of uh, labor and uh, energy in total uh, cost respectively 
and uh, these are some of the parameter estimates and uh, standard errors for this equation these uh, have been given in um, William H. Green book and uh, then there are estimated elasticities the fitted share and the actual share and then we have implied elasticities of substitution for capital labor energy and materials and uh, finally we have implied own price elasticities for uh, capital labor energy and uh, material and you can go through these figures uh, we will also estimate the nonlinear seemingly unrelated uh, regression for the same data uh, in uh, strata so to do that i will open my data file here is the file first of all i would like to show you the data and uh, here is uh, the data this is a uh, uh, this is time period 1947 annual data up to 1971 there are 25 observation this is total cost function this is a capital share in the total cost and uh, this is the labor share in the total cost this is the energy share in the total cost this is the manufacturing share in the total cost this is price of capital price of labor and price of energy and uh, price of uh, material so this is the data uh, that is available online you can download it and uh, we will use this data in order to estimate the nonlinear seemingly unrelated regression equation for the um, input share in the total cost since we have normalized this equation by the price of uh, uh, materials so we will have three share equations and uh, if I press this command which I have written uh, this will estimate nonlinear seemingly unrelated regression so this is the iterative method let me show you the command this is the this is the command for uh, this model that i just uh, press uh, nonlinear seemingly unrelated this is the uh, capital share in the total cost equation this is the labor share in the total cost equation and this is the um, energy share in the total cost equation up to this point and finally uh, we have given this command uh, um, iterative uh, feasible generalized non least squares so these are uh, iterations and uh, finally uh, we have uh, these are the fg nls regressions there are three equations and these are the equation level statistics the total number of observations in the three equations are 25 the number of parameters in each equation are four these are the root mean square errors of the residuals for uh, all the three equations this is these are the these are the r squared and uh, since this model uh, has uh, identified constant so these are the actual r squared if there were no constant in these equations then they would have uh, the strata would have given um, uncentered uh, r squared uh, in this table uh, we have the uh, coefficient estimates uh, of the, the various uh, variables or the various uh, inputs uh, that uh, we have used in the above model. So this is a coefficient for uh, capital and uh, this is KK, this is a coefficient for uh, labor and this is the coefficient for energy, uh, this is uh, for uh, labor and this is for uh, dll the second derivative and this is the energy and this is for uh, energy also and finally this is the um, with respect to energy that is the log square of uh, energy so these are the coefficient estimates and uh, this is the estimation of the trans log uh, cost function and uh, you can uh, fit this equation in the uh, the equation that we have shown you here in this and then you can say uh, beta k value is there estimated this is a lambda kk this is lambda kl and this is lambda ke so all coefficients are there so you can plug in uh, plug in uh, the co estimated coefficient in this uh, equation and uh, then we have the cost share of capital the cost share of uh, labor and the cost share of uh, energy Ladies and gentlemen, this is a, a very brief and uh, simple estimation of uh, 
the translog cost function for the US manufacturing sector because the data have, has been given. Uh, this is available online and uh, in the uh, on the web. So, you can download the data and you can play with the data. So, I hope this was uh, quite helpful for you. Uh, thanks for uh, stopping by. Uh, <clears throat> if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel kindly, do subscribe to the channel and uh, don't forget to click on the bell icon. You will get uh, notification about uh, my other videos that will be uploaded for you. Uh, thanks for watching. Kindly share various videos of this channel in various WhatsApp groups. Thank you and uh, see you in another video soon.